hello you guys welcome to my channel and for today's video we're going to be making sudanese cookies and we're just gonna get right into it so before we get started thank you so much if you're already a subscriber to me and if you're new to this channel welcome and please subscribe to my channel and also like this video if you like it then so then i can make more videos in the future and if you have any ideas and if you have any questions regarding any of my videos please feel free to reach out to me thank you so much for your love and support i really do appreciate it okay let's get started guys so i'm going to be using eggs butter ghee all-purpose flour powdered sugar and if you don't have powdered sugar you can also use just regular sugar and this is baking powder vanilla extract and if you have the powder that can also be that can also work baking soda a cup of milk and if you don't have milk you can also use water or powdered milk so I'm going to be using this container here to mix up all the ingredients and since I don't have a mixing machine, I'm going to be mixing everything the old-fashioned way, using my hands. So first things first, I'm going to add my 2 cups of butter, 5 eggs, 2 cups of powdered sugar, and also 2 cups of ghee before I add the remaining liquid stuff. gonna mix it so now I'm just adding in four tablespoons of vanilla So I'm going to take one tablespoon of baking powder and also one tablespoon of baking soda. Then I'm going to take my one cup of milk and mix it all together. Once it's all mixed, then I'm going to pour it into the main mix. So I just finished mixing all the ingredients with the flour and this is how your dough should look like. So I'm going to be using my cookie press that I got from Target. So this is the same tool that I also use to make BT4s but since I don't have a machine I'm going to be using this last design that you guys are going to see here and it's just a straight line and it has zigzag edges. So confession you guys, this is actually my first time ever using a cookie press to make this kind of style of Sudanese cookies. I usually use a machine and a machine is a lot easier than this and but this is a great alternative for those who don't have a machine like myself. So I had my oven at 350 Fahrenheit and I baked the cookies for about 15 to 25 minutes and I checked regularly and 
reduce the heat accordingly. Based on when I seen that some of the cookies were getting a little bit browner at the bottom. So this is it. This is the final product and it looks so good and it also tastes so good. So thank you guys so much for tuning in and see you guys next time. Bye.